Hello lovely people! Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. And for today's video, I am going to show you Tory Birch Vista Village. So, yep, I'm only gonna talk about the Tory Birch in Vista Village and my experience during my shopping here and of course the prices. And at the end of this video, I'm gonna be showing you what I bought and how much it cost me. So, let's start talking about my shopping here in Tory Birch Vista Village. And while I am talking, you can just go ahead and look at all the items that I am picking up and their prices. So now this leather jacket was 1230 but after discount, it became 819 And then another 50% off, so it's only 410 after that. So it's actually really good. And there are more clothes as well. I noticed the clothes the bags the shoes they are all like resembling the design of gucci and chanel and other um high-end brands but the price of course is so different like this bag i actually end up buying this okay i am already spoiling this but it's the last piece and it's really really cheap so i bought it and then this bag I also like this because of the color. It's really, really pretty. I like the size as well. It's It also has a black si uh, color and it's really cheap. When I came here, everything is 40% off. Now, 40% off, that is on top of the sale price. So let's say the item is already reduced to 50% off then you will get another 40% off on top of that. That's for every everything, every single thing aside from clothing. Because in clothing, everything is 50% off after the reduced price. So it's actually very good. Even their accessories, I find them really nice. Um, it's just that I couldn't wear... Um, accessories that are not real gold it just irritates my skin now here I am again couldn't make up my mind whether to get this brown bag or these black bags that look like Chanel they are really good and the prices are also really really good and then here are more classic looking bags and wallets they're just so good shades as well and these are like summer colors but i really like it this one it reminds me of gucci like as i said the design i think is just resembling gucci and chanel and other high-end brand like as i said they have belts now this bag is also nice it's like chanel and the red color i can use it for valentine's or chinese new year it's just so nice and um people are also nice here this white bag is also nice i have one uh bag that is similar to this but it's chanel and it's black it's just white is my favorite color and I think this will be good for summer as well. I think they have a really good uh, collection. This tiny bag is also like a summer bag, but it's just so tiny. Even if I really like it, I don't know what I can put inside it. But yeah, the price is also nice. And these little bags is just like a mess. Um, my friends bought the red one because it's good for Chinese New Year, also Valentine's, and it's just her favorite color. And again, the price is very reasonable. So I think they are so good if you don't want to spend so much in high-end uh, brands like MS. And then the Q, if you're lucky and you get there before the Q gets long, then it's good because it can get really really long so yeah now i'm gonna go ahead and show you what i bought and how much they cost so as you can see i have a few bags here to open so 
I'm gonna do my best not to keep this video long and I don't want to bore you. So I'm gonna start opening them now. <laughs> right, let's start with this with this bag, okay? So this one has a bag inside it. So and this is how it looked like. So. so it's a leather and it looks like that inside it has pocket here with the zipper and it has pockets here as well and then put this back outside there's this pocket and then You pull this and then yeah like this but this bag I am NOT keeping this I am giving it away as a present this Christmas so I'm gonna give it to a friend who's coming over here and this is how it looked like and then here you can adjust the strap it's very simple but it's classic and i like classic as you know so i chose it it's similar to my um gucci bag but it has different um openings but still it kind of look the same so i like it i bought it <laughs> right but yeah like as i said this is not gonna be mine it's not mine to keep oh the receipt is not here okay um i will check later since it's gonna be a present i removed the receipt but i will tell you later what how much it is okay now the next one is this bag i think you can already tell what's inside it's so big All right there you go okay and it is these boots you know i have a lot of boots that look like this um i don't know i just like it i like that detail there it's just very simple and yeah i just like it it's a good leather and of course it gives me extra height but i do like it this one is definitely mine there you go. Yeah. Let me see if I can find the receipt. Um oh no. Wait, let me check. Oh no, it's not here. Okay. I don't know where I put the receipt. I'm gonna check it later and I'm gonna tell you how much I paid for this okay All right, let's move on to the next one right. this is the next one okay it is a coat there it is cashmere it's similar to my other coat. I have a lot of, not a lot, but I have few coats that is similar to this, but I just like how plain this one is. And of course, I do like the price. So here, this one has a price. It was 855 pounds. There you go. It was 855 pounds and then it was 
it was reduced to 569 and then that 569 i get another 50 percent of that so in the end i only paid 280 yeah so 280 pounds for this it is made of cashmere and it's a long trench coat i'm gonna try to see if i can try it on later and then i'll show you how it looked like on me okay so let's put this back i think it's a very good deal especially it's cashmere so i like it and the price is good so i bought it and then the last but not the least of course is this one. okay it's the boots okay so it looks like this I really like them. I don't think I have this kind of color of boots. I think I left it in Hong Kong. But yeah, I like it. It's very simple, but I think it's good if there's a snow because it has a good grip. It's a bit heavy though, but yeah, I think I like it. It's I think it's classic. It's not black. <laughs> guys you have to see my uncle boots collection there's a lot of them <laughs> all right let's put this back oh the price i don't know where i put the receipt but i will look for it and then i'm gonna explain to you and show you the price of the boots and the bag and also i'm gonna show you how the boots look like on me and the coat okay so this is the receipt of the coat and the two ankle boots the coat was 800 something and the reduced price was 569 and after 50 percent off i only paid 284.50 pounds while the brown boots i can't remember the original price but the sale price was 289 and after 30 percent off i only paid 86.70 pounds and the black boots i also can't remember the original price but the reduced price was 269 and after 30 percent off i only paid 80.70 pounds so i think that is actually a very good price now unfortunately i could not find the receipt of the black bag but i remember it being 50 percent off and then another 40 percent off after the reduced price now here i am wearing the coat and the black boots and i really really like them all right so i hope you like my shopping and you can tell me which one's your favorite as usual and if you're new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe and if you like this video give it a thumbs up Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye!